Hey guys, welcome back or welcome to my channel if you're new. So a couple of weeks ago, I asked you guys what you guys think are some of the ugliest K-pop light sticks. And honestly, y'all delivered. Some of the ones that you guys submitted, I have never seen before. And to say that I was gagged is really an understatement. Y'all were also submitting good like actual cute light sticks. So I was really confused with some of the submissions. But I guess art is subjective right? Anyways though, let's get into some disclaimers. This video is just being made for fun and entertainment purposes, so like no hate towards the people who created these light stick designs. And also, if I just so happen to rank your favorite light stick low, I'm sorry but it's just how I feel. With that being said, I hope you enjoy and let's get into the video. Wow! Okay so like, I don't know anything about Block B right? Like all I know is that they made that one song Subin sung and it went viral. The most research I did for this video was just simply look up the light sticks. Because I'm lazy. So I don't know if this light stick has a meaning or something. But like I'm sure they could have expressed that meaning in a completely different way because what is this? Like Bumblebee is that you? On the bright side though. It will definitely stand out in a crowd. I remember seeing this light stick a little while ago, and just being shocked to put it lightly. The idea they had to make it a radish is cute. Like the meaning is cute. But I just can't get behind how the light stick looks. Like you know how there's some light sticks that you see, and you have no idea which group it belongs to. But it's so pretty that you want to buy it anyways. This is definitely not one of those type of light sticks. <laughs> It looks like a superhero logo or something. Like that's instantly what I thought of when I first saw this design. And that could work if it was a superhero design. I'm not sure if it's working as a light stick though. But I wonder how it looks lit up. This is definitely one of the funny ones. Like why is it a bowling pin? I feel like it's so random. I know it probably might have a meaning. But like really. A bowling pin. How big is it? Is it like life size? Like is it the same size as an actual bowling pin? Because if it is, I think that's so funny. And it low-key kinda might be dangerous. Don't whack nobody with it. I think I saw a fan-made light stick and it absolutely ate this one up. I just feel like they could've went very pretty with the light stick. Like how the fan did. Because when I think of Fromis 9, I don't know, I just think pretty. They always have a pretty concept, they have pretty voices, the girls in general are very pretty, but they decided to not go down the pretty route, and instead go down the boring route, and to that I say, they fumbled the bag. <laughs> What am I looking at? I'm not even saying that in a mean way either. Like genuinely. What am I looking at? I guess it gets bonus points though. Because the blue color they chose for it is pretty. I feel like the designs that you can't even tell what they're supposed to be. Should automatically be a big no-no. I feel like a lot of end citizens like this light stick. Personally I am not one of those end citizens. But I know that a lot of K-pop stands that aren't NCT fans think that this design is ugly. Understandable honestly. I agree. People were telling me that this design is supposed to be NCT. Like it's supposed to look like a bunch of buildings. I can't see it. People were telling me it spells out NCT. I can't see that either. But I'll give them the benefit of the doubt that maybe I'm tripping. Anyways though I'm not a fan of the design. Wavies is worst though. Like I was digging through my submissions to try and find a wavy submission. I couldn't find one. But I'm saying it now. Wavies is not appealing to the eye at all. Someone told me that it was supposed to be a bird. And I'm not seeing it. JYP absolutely slayed with Twice's light stick. Well their version 1 light stick at least. And then gave GOT7 that. That's crazy. Hey, 
I will never understand the chokehold neon green has on K-pop companies. Like I get it, it stands out, but there are other neon colors that stand out. Anyways though, it's a green bunny, it's kinda evil looking, kinda scary looking, and I'm not a fan of it, but I think having it as a little character instead of doing something basic, like putting the name of the group inside of a plastic dome, all shade, is pretty cool. Not saying that I like this more than those though, because I would be lying. A for effort though. The design is kind of funky, like the design honestly looks like something I would see on a t-shirt made for children, and I should know because I feel like I had a t-shirt with a similar design on it, but anyways, I wouldn't buy it, I don't know why they went with this design, but it's unique, so I guess they get bonus points for that. I think I said that their light stick was ugly in a K-pop opinions video, and I still stand by that honestly, I guess it's different, but like different don't always mean good, I just don't know why it's a ring, that mess would definitely fly right out of my hand, and I know that because of my experiences with my Mario Kart controllers, like I need grip, I literally saw this light stick recently, like I didn't even know this was Itzy's light stick until I saw videos of their tour, so I was shocked to say the least. Because Twice's version 1 is god tier, fumbled with god 7s, and fumbled with itsies. Who's next? Oh god, I can only imagine what horror I'm about to lay my eyes upon when it comes to extinary heroes. They can either do the design really well, or really bad. So let's just keep our fingers crossed. And Mixes is okay though. Like I thought it was about to be horrendous, but the whale is actually kinda cute. <laughs> It's boring, before making this video, I had no idea what EXO's light stick looked like, I was expecting something that stood out like NCT's, but clearly that's not the case, SM can do better, they have the money to do so. I was so disappointed when I saw this design, it's not bad to look at, it's just so boring, I thought the design was going to be a crown or something. Like that would have ate, and it would have made sense. I know Starship aren't known for having the best light sticks. That title definitely belongs to YG, but WJSN's Monster X's and Cravities aren't that bad. Actually, Cravities can be better, but it's not the worst thing in the world. I've deserved better though. Honestly, I feel the same way about this light stick as I do with the IVE one. It's too basic. It's too boring, but it has a tiny bit of color on it, so it gets bonus points but not really. I know there's like a lot of chaos around this light stick. Do I think carrots are being a little overdramatic? Yes, but I understand why they're mad. This is definitely a step down compared to their other light sticks. Like 17 has really pretty colors. And I really don't understand why they decided to change what they had going on. It's not really a bad light stick though. It's just not the 17 light stick carrots know and love. I know it's supposed to be a bunny. But it looks like a controller. Like guys. Do y'all see my vision? Just flip it upside down and boom. You have a controller now. I don't know though. I'm kinda neutral on this design. I don't think it's bad but Hive definitely could've done better. Like they could've went so cute with it. Hell they could've made it the actual new jeans bunny. See y'all. Why do these K-pop companies keep fumbling the bag? I think the idea is cute. Like it's supposed to be a planet. And that's Kepler's whole thing. Like that's their concept. But it's so simple. Like they just should have ditched the Kepler logo, and instead should have had the whole light stick as a planet. Sue me, I'm biased. I like the BTS bomb and I want it so badly. I know it's like super basic and generic, but like I still want it. Me and my friends were the only people at that BTS concert without a BTS bomb because everything was so last minute, so I couldn't get one. 
like it was truly giving poor. I had my phone flashlight on and everything. Embarrassing but anyways. That in itself just makes me want it more. Like I wanna dress it up and decorate it with koi emerge. And I'm so mad that I don't have one. As for the actual design though. It makes sense. Like their name is BTS. They're the bulletproof boy scouts. Their fandom name is ARMY. Like it makes sense that their light stick would be a bomb. Like are the dots not connecting? I think they are. I know y'all are tired of armies defending the basic ass army bombs. But I just had to add to the mix. Who would I be if I didn't? I was actually shocked to see this light stick submission because I don't think it's bad at all. Like it's definitely not one of my favorites. But it's not bad to look at. And the person who sent this in specifically said version 2. Which is crazy to me because this version looks 10 times better than version 1. But anyways we move. The first thing that came to my mind is. Is it hard to hold? Like I don't know why but I just feel like it would slide right out of my hand. You know when I went to that BTS concert. I was dancing. Like I'm telling y'all I got in a good workout that night. I didn't have a BTS bomb. But like if I did. I was all the way in the back. And hella high up. We were at the MetLife Stadium. Like I would be damned if my non-existent light stick flew out of my hand. Because I know I would not be getting it back. Also what if that mess hit someone in the head. That would be tragic. That's why I have this concern you know. And also how big are they. Or should I say it. I don't know why but I feel like it would be tiny. And I know there's like two TVXQ members. So do you get two light sticks in one pack or. These are real concerns y'all. I don't think the design is bad though. I like the stars. I think they're cute. People always call this light stick ugly but I have to disagree heavily. I just love that it's a bat. I don't know why it's a bat. I don't know why it's that color. But honestly I'm just happy that they chose a color other than neon green. Like it stands out. You can see their light stick from a mile away. It just works and I want one. Honestly it's really simple. But like, in the best way possible. I just think it's so pretty. Like the color they used for it is so pretty. And I really like the shape of it. It's probably the best SM light stick. Who submitted this? It's literally an ice cream cone. Please tell me you're not being serious. This light stick is like the cutest thing ever. And I want one. About to go search for it on eBay. Same with this one. Isn't it supposed to be a megaphone? Like that's so cute. I remember the first time I saw this light stick. I was so starstruck because I thought it was so cute. And also different. Like I haven't seen anyone else with a megaphone light stick. And it's heart shape. Like it's entertainment. You can take my money. I can definitely say the same thing about a pink's light stick. Ist once again. Take my money. People say this light stick is creepy. But honestly I don't know what those people are talking about. When I look at it. I don't get creepy. I get adorable. Like it's so cute. It's a pink panda. And I want it so badly. Please be so for real. You didn't even send in version 2. You hit me with version 1. Which is crazy. Like it's a lollipop. Y'all must hate fun and cute things. Someone literally sent in cherry bullets light stick. But I refuse to put it on this list. That light stick and the one I'm about to show are literally my favorite light sticks ever. Y'all gotta be playing with me. Okay so I'm going to be so real with y'all. The only reason why I think people were submitting this one is because they don't like Blackpink. Because there's no way you genuinely mean this light stick is ugly. It might not be your taste. But you can't tell me it's a bad design. Because you would be lying. Like I feel like you can guess whose light stick this belongs to without being into K-pop light sticks like that. And I'm not judging you but like. 
I'm judging you. It's not too over the top, but it's not bland at all either. It's perfect. It's a black and pink hammer. Their name is Blackpink and their concept is girl crush. Like the design is cute and it makes so much sense. It really doesn't get any better than that. Wow! Okay guys that's it for this video. I don't know when this video is going up. It might be at like a different time than usual. But that's only because I'm at my best friend's crib. And I'm going to be here for two weeks. So I'm just trying to get this video out to y'all as soon as possible. Anyways though. I love y'all for real. It was a rough ride editing this video. I'm pretty sure my fave on Boys Planet got eliminated. And I'm 6 0. -oh. Thank God I was able to edit through the pain. Alright, let me stop rambling and end this video. I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope to see you in my next one. Take literally everything I said in this video with a grain of sand. Because, like I said at the beginning of this video, this video is just being made for fun and entertainment purposes. Don't forget to support Santa Yacht and Moon Hun Bin on Fantasy Boys. They changed the date of when the show starts. So it's airing on the 30th of March instead of the 24th. You can watch it and also vote on the Naver Now app. Thank you so much for watching. I love you so much. And bye bye. Wow! Yeah, 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 yeah.